I think we're in the very early days of wearable technology and our vision with Misfit Wearables Shine uh, was to create a product that was uh, so elegant and so simple uh, that you could wear it and not even have to think about it because the real value of it is to be able to capture data, to be able to analyze it because this data can go up into to the cloud and be able to track how you are doing from an activity standpoint but it can also let you set goals for yourself. So the whole concept of wearable products, we think, is to make them last a long time, and that's why you don't have to recharge the battery. Uh, this can last for maybe six months. Uh, that the data is really tracked inside of your iPhone, um, and it's all transmitted wirelessly, even though this is a solid aircraft-grade aluminum. And it's uh, something you can wear even when you're swimming. I mean, you can go down almost 100 meters. So it's pretty novel in that sense. Uh, women are particularly uh, attracted to it uh, because they can wear it anywhere. And uh, it's quite elegant. And uh, I believe that uh, it's going to appeal to people of all ages because it's, you know, it can be worn uh, in so many different ways. I think the real difference between Misfit Wearables and some of the other activity tracker companies is that uh, we are doing both um, software and hardware. Majority of our people are computer scientists and data scientists, and so they're focused on the data that's being captured by our Shine product, and other products that we're working on for the future will also be able to give you more ways in which you can track data and, and be able to build predictive analytics. So in healthcare, I believe that uh, we're in the early days of the consumer era of health, where people will take on a role in their own health and wellness. That's what's called outcomes-based medicine. Uh, it's also known as the quantified self. You know, in other words, giving people a chance to actually have metrics uh, to measure how they're, they're doing from a health and wellness standpoint. That's all part of the, I think, the um, direction in which wearable products are going.